Enola Holmes 2 is just around the corner, which means we don't have much time to unravel the mysteries of the long-awaited sequel. The first film was a huge success for Netflix, so much so that it even surprised Brown. I really didn't think it would be a success as it was, she admitted in October 2022. I thought, there's so much potential here, but I didn't realize how much potential. Millie Bobby Brown recently shared how she feels about how empowering the movie is. In today's video, we are going to tell you why Millie Bobby Brown is super excited for Enola Holmes 2. But before we get into the video, make sure you subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update. Despite Enola's signature wit still sitting front and center, as per the trailer, the Netflix sequel is expected to explore more serious themes. We wanted this to be more of a grown-up film with a grittier, more dangerous story. Brad Beer said in an interview with Netflix Q, we wanted to tell a story that brought Enola into contact with people outside her background and class by introducing her to working girls of her own age. That was something I was very excited about, and so that's where the Match Factory idea came in. While early reviews of Enola Holmes 2 are divided on the film's overall merit, they almost universally praise the connection between Millie Bobby Brown's Enola and Henry Cavill's Sherlock as the highlight of the forthcoming sequel. Based on the young adult novels by author Nancy Springer, the Enola Holmes franchise draws from Sir Arthur Conan Doyle's fictional universe of Sherlock Holmes and offers the brilliant detective a younger sister who demonstrates her own deductive prowess. Originally slated for a theatrical release, Enola Holmes' debut film was picked up by Netflix in the wake of the COVID-19 pandemic and quickly became a major milestone for the streaming giant. While Enola Holmes 2 has the benefit of featuring two of Netflix's biggest and most bankable stars, the question is whether the second installment will live up to the success of the first film. During the original's initial release window, Netflix reported that it was on track to reach 76 million homes within the first four weeks of availability. It would also receive an impressive 91% critical rating on review aggregator site Rotten Tomatoes. Recently, Millie Bobby Brown spoke to Access Hollywood at the premiere of Enola Holmes 2 and shared her thoughts of the film's empowerment. She also shared her real-life connection to her co-star, Henry Cavill, as well as her love for Rihanna, who is releasing new music, and Nola Holmes 2 will be released worldwide on Netflix on November 4, 2022. Talking about Rihanna and her new music, after weeks and weeks, rumors began to circulate that Rihanna would return to music. It has been officially confirmed. The singer herself teased that her first single in six years, Lift Me Up, will be released this Friday as part on the Black Panther Wakanda Forever soundtrack. Co-written by Tim's Ludwig van Gorensen and director Ryan Coogler, the song is a tribute to the late Chadwick Boseman. Rihanna worked hard. According to multiple critics, the star has a second song called Born Again that also plays during the credits. This one is produced by The Dream and both are ballads, according to Kyle Buchanan of the New York Times. With plenty of investigation, a great deal of self-discovery, and a dash of social reformation forming the heart of the Enola Holmes 2 film, it's shaping up to be an exciting watch. That's all for today. Share your thoughts in the comments section below, and don't forget to like this video before leaving. Thanks for watching.